Okay, there's the winds today. Not bad. Not bad at all. Not too bad. Oops. I was supposed to fly four cells this morning, but I left my adapters on my battery charging table. I need to put in to the tundra. So this flight will be six cell. My only flight since I got my new graphene batteries that I was going to uh, cycle for the first time. So that means I'll have probably have to come back. Threats of thunderstorms or gale winds. I'm flying with my same prop that I have on my Flex Innovation 170 Cessna. I've made modifications to the landing gear. today. stall from that height. Well, I doubt if I'll get it out before she gets down. I still haven't ordered my new spinner yet, or not spinner, but prop adapter. Mine's got a slight bend in the very end. Time has stopped. So I'm sure. Time has stopped. I have some jury rigged motor motor mount bolts. Junkyard dog, Grand Tundra. Time to stop. Alright, this will be some landing too. Time to stop. Landing flaps. Time to stop. Time to start. Time remaining, five minutes. Gonna put it on the line. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. That's pretty close to the line. Not bad. A little bouncy. I don't. My tail wheel didn't bend. It's not gonna bend. I can just about guarantee it. I just about guarantee it's not going to bend anymore, hopefully. If that's as bad as landing as I have, we'll be cold. Alright, let's see if we can land a crosswind here. Take off flaps, landing flaps, time to stop. Let's get time it off. To stop. Bring it over in the line. I'll take that. Time to start. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. Not greasy, but with flaps, you're not Time gonna. In this wind and flaps, stop. you're not gonna get super greasy. Flaps up. Landing gear mods holding up. Time 
Man, I wanted to fly the four cells battery and try the graphene. And them graphene batteries from Hobby King, they come they come in a you think you're buying gold bars or silver, come in a nice black box with a magnetic catch on it in a little foam, packed in foam. Landing flaps, take off flaps. Yeah, we're just gonna take do take low flaps. Black bag. The thing is, though, the graphene, I noticed they're a heavier battery because that 4000 battery almost weighs as much as a Zippy Compact 6 cell that I'm flying with now, 4000. Of course, it's all, I don't have a scale, so. Time to start. Trying to bring it down here so we can see the landing. All right, landing. Time to start. Yeah, not bad. A little wind, you're going to get a little bounce. Landing flaps. Flaps up. Rut with flaps. Let's get, it back on the, let's get it back on the runway. Wind, just for those that are playing along, wind's blowing like right here. Right here. Right in this area, right here. See it. I can't believe I brought got those adapters. Linda's gonna be my wife's gonna be coming over with the dog, but she <laughs> adapters. Well, I might try. There's only well I got the big blue and yellow ones. Time she might stop. be able to handle that. Time stop. No flaps. Time stop. Time stop. Time stop. Time stop. Time stop. All right, just between you, me, and Mr. GT there, I think the no flaps is definitely smoother. Believe it or not, I kind of lost orientation there in, in the sun and the clouds for half a second. Let's see if we can get a better half flap. Take off flaps. Time to stop. The wind's coming up. Time to start. Time remaining two minutes. Time to stop. Time to start. Time to stop. Time to stop. Time to stop. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's insane. Like I said, it's about seven, seven to eleven. The sun's bright, so I'm not going to go into the sun again. Not a smart thing to do. All right, that was half flat. So let's go full flaps again. Man, you see, you hear that power I put on it to keep it from thumping in because it was coming down. So I nailed the power. <sighs> Show you what I did. Probably about 11, maybe 12 on the high dust. Not a bad day, perfect day really. Okay, there you can see what I did. That is JB Quick. I just took the landing gear off. I was gonna put, I got a, a carbon fiber, I was gonna put it on, but I couldn't get the wheel. I couldn't get the tail wheel out of that little plastic cross piece. I couldn't get it out of this. 
right here. No matter what I tried, I couldn't pull it out. So I, I figured, well, we'll just go with the JB Quick Wrap. And I think it's going to work fine. Granted, I haven't splatted it in yet, but I gotta check my prop. Everything's nice and tight. Spiders this battery out. So it doesn't take forever to get into storage. So I have to take those batteries down without using the storage. Probably going to take two sessions. Holy cow, I touched that way down. I wasn't even expecting to touch down. I don't know what the heck is wrong with me. I wasn't even expecting to come down. <laughs> well, I guess we've tested the tail wheel. All right, we got to get a landing. I can't quit with that landing. <laughs> oh, that was good. Holy cow. Your tundra, Grand Tundra. That was a good flight. I think my landing gear thing is going to work just fine. And uh, if I could figure out how to get that wheel out, I'd, I'd have a carbon on there, but I don't think I'm going to need it. <laughs> 